Hey, it's John, your Gen X grandpa, and today we're going to talk about this thing, the Ryobi 18-volt inflator. I unboxed it a few weeks ago, and I want to talk to you about using this thing and my experiences so far with it. So, I purchased this a couple weeks ago, and I have to say that so far I'm pretty happy with it. I'm going to show you a little bit of B-roll as I'm talking about it. This inflator comes with a couple of little adapters here that you can use to uh, inflate uh, pool, you know, little blow up things, the ones you blow up by hand. And it's got your typical tire attachment. You can attach a needle to it for basketballs, soccer balls, footballs, things like that. And one of the best features I think about this is that it works with your existing 18 volt batteries. So if you already have Ryobi tools like this, this is just like a $25 add-on. So it's very inexpensive to get one of these. It's lightweight. I mean, without the battery, this thing is like a featherweight. And even with the battery, it's not that heavy. So it's lightweight, Whoop! it's portable. And you know, you can keep it in your car, you can keep it in your garage, however you wanna choose to do that. One of the downsides to it is you can probably see now that it's, it's lit up, it's kinda of hard to see, unfortunately. Yeah, it's lit up now, but it's, the only reason it's lit up is because I hit the button. You cannot check air pressures with this. In order to check the air pressure, you actually have to use the pump and wait for it to work. And another thing that I've noticed about it is that you actually have to pump it up about two pounds. So when you're actively pumping it up, it's off by about two pounds while air is flowing into whatever you're inflating and you let go and then you get your reading. That's kind of really the biggest drawback to this thing is you can't actually just check tire pressures with it which would be really great it would be nice to have a like maybe a button on the back or maybe something over here on the side here so that you can just check pressures but that's not available another thing is this feels a little cheap but you know i wouldn't say 100 percent that it's uh it's cheap i've used it to air up my car tires. I've used it to air up the tire on my lawnmower. And so far, I have no complaints about it. It works as expected. And like I said, I'm pretty happy with it. This kind of where you're supposed to store this is a little, I don't know, it's a little flimsy too. But these are all just kind of minor little nitpicks, I guess you could say, about this particular product. So the Ryobi 18 volt power inflator works with your ex existing batteries. I would say that this is a good value if you already own products that have the 18 volt batteries. Otherwise it's like a hundred bucks and I think that's too much because really essentially what's happening is you're getting the inflator for free and you're paying a hundred bucks for two batteries and a charger that the kit comes in. So in that case, I, I wouldn't say, unless you already have plans to buy other tools or you want additional batteries, just buy the electric tool and use it with the batteries that you have so far. All right, that's a quick review, again, of the Ryobi 18 volt power inflator. I hope that you'll check out my other reviews that are coming up and I'll talk to you next time. Bye.